Hello and welcome to Disney Dreamlight Valley. Today we're doing Bill Friendship Quest and I cannot wait to start. I absolutely love this character and I do not understand all the hate she's getting on the way she looks. I think she's gorgeous. I might have a little crush on her. They just, the, the model that they did for this game is just, it, it's just flawless in my opinion. Also, I've never been inside this house, so. And also, you probably can hear my echo right now. Let me fix that real quick. Here you go. So that's their castle. Wow. They have a bath. Which Beast definitely cannot fit in. They have... Oh, painting arrangement. I want this. Is this a new bookshelf that we can get, possibly? This looks gorgeous. Where do they sleep? Do they sleep on this little couch? Two of them? Nah. <laughs> this is such a small castle. I'm so glad we get to talk. Okay, now I finally heard her voice. Like a, a full-blown line. It fits her. I don't know. I, I, It's been many years since I watched the original one. And I didn't even watch it in original dubs. I watched it in, in Russian translation. Uh, and it's... It makes sense to me. As a person who doesn't have a perfect image of how she's supposed to look and sound, to me she sounds and looks perfect. So, I'm sorry guys. I'm I'm a, I'm in a Bell Fun Club for sure. Yes, book-related problem. Thank you. Uh, I would love to help you. When I came to your valley, I had to pack lightly. So I could only bring a few books. And I've already read most of them. Of course, you read every time I'm trying to take a picture of you. I'd like to read something new, if I asked Merlin if I could borrow from a Dreamlight library, but he said no. He explained that too many books have been borrowed in the past and not returned. Oh, come on, Belle is one of the most studious persons I've ever known, so she will definitely return it. I know Merlin practically lives in there, but those books belong to all of us. I think he feels like it's his responsibility to watch over the books, and he's rather frustrated. I'd like to make sure that the library be open, so I was wondering if you could help me locate some of the missing books and bring them back. Wait, so the library is inside Merlin's house? Okay. Why don't I get half of the books from the list while you get the other half? Uh. My god! She's the first person that actually helps. At least we're splitting it in half. Anybody else? Would be like, okay, go find all the books, I'm gonna sit here, do nothing, and expect results. IMMEDIATELY! <laughs> Could you go see Goofy, Mirabel, Mr. McDuck, and Remy and ask if the library book's back? WHAT?! Mirabel and Mi M Mr. McDuck?! Oh, this is Didn't return a book?! How is that possible? Scrooge, you disappoint me! Scrooge, you better, you better have a very good reason for this. Oh, look how convenient. Mirabel is here, too. Hello there. Wait, he, she needs. Fr I bought a, I borrowed a book of so empowering and crafty creatures from the library, but then, but then I saw Remy and he wanted me to taste the new arepas he made, which of course I had to do, <laughs> of course. And now I can find the book. Somebody's stealing books, guys. I my bed right now it's Stitch. He probably think th thinks it's a sandwich and he eats them. That, that's just my guess. I might be completely wrong here. But anyway, let's find out. The valley is so amazing and there's always something happening, so I must have gotten distracted. Yes, you did. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Last place I remember having it was in the plaza when I was feeding the squirrels. All right, I'll find it. Detective Starren's guy is on the, on the job. Yes. So wait, let me get this straight. You lost the book. You know exactly when was the last time you saw it. It was. It's, you're saying it's somewhere in plaza. You are in plaza right now. You can literally just go out the door and look for your book. Instead, you waited for me to come to you just to tell me to go look for your book. Mirabel, I thought you were supposed to be helpful. You're useless. Scrooge, you better have a better reason. Good day, dear. Moana, don't distract me. I'm on a mission. I cannot wait to hear what the opportunity you have for me today. It's more about something you have for me, actually. Belle and I are looking for missing books from the library. And you're supposed to have one of them. Uh -huh. Coin pool theory is a fascinating subject. In fact, I have a mind to keep it for myself. What? It belongs to the library, Scrooge. 
No need to ruffle your feathers. I would have reimbursed the library, of this course. Really shows that everybody's but unfortunately, no, I no longer have the book. <laughs> bet bet he, he lost it. Very humorous. I was on a dazzle bitch digging for treasure, but alas, I couldn't find even a rusted farting. What? What? <laughs> okay. To get a bit of relief from the sun, I sat down in one of the holes I dug and decided to do some reading. After a spell, I got up and filled it all the holes I'd made. Ah. ah, of course. So basically, the book is going to be lying down in a plaza. Another book is going to be, uh, we have to dig out from the set. Am I bothering you right now, Mo Moana? All right, I'll go dig it up. Fine, don't worry about it. Uh, who else? Who else? Where did Goofy and Remy? Remy just distracted Mirabel and stole her book. I know what you're up to, Remy. You're a bad boy. Which book did he get? I wonder. I bet it was a cooking recipe book. Hello. Bella and I are gathering books borrowed from the library, and you want me to return the one I borrowed? Trust me, I wish I could. Unfortunately, there is one small problem. You ate it. I lost it. Okay, close enough. I'll find it. That would be great. If anybody can do it, it's you. Okay, here's what happened. I was reading the novel, Extraordinary Rat Ventures. Oh, not a cooking book. I'm surprised. About a rat adventurer on the pontoon on Dazzle Beach, and then you dropped it in the water. Ah, oh, of course. But then Donald tripped on the turtle and started yelling... <laughs> I, I know I've been there. He, he startled me so much I dropped the book in the water. It's gonna be ruined, right? Oh yeah, there's probably an enchantment. All right, I'll fish it out. We work well as a team. I thought. Okay, so pick up pick, pick up one book, dig out another one. Uh, so Goofy, let me guess, he got it stuck in a rock. So now we need to mine it. <laughs> that, that's the only explanation I have. I got the book right here. Ooh. Please tell me, Marilyn, I'm real sorry. Oh, really? What the hell? I thought... The book is called Bear in Mind. What kind of book is this? It's about helping you not forget anything. Ooh. And was remembering a lot of stuff, so I thought it worked. <laughs> but then I forgot to return the book, so I guess it didn't. Wow, that was a plot twist. I did not see that coming, that's for sure. All right, where would Mar Maribel read her book? She was feeding the squirrels. I have my plaza stuffed so much. I kind of want to tear it down and make it less stuffed because there's like too much things going. Oh, that was easy. Well, that wasn't a book, but I'll take the night shard. How do I know which one of these is a book? Maybe it has like a book sticking out of it. But my beach is also very covered. Is this one? Scrooge dug too many holes, man. That poor, hard-working duck. Just digging himself into a grave. With all the hard work that he does. I don't know much about books. But that wasn't a book. That was a fish. And I literally fished every single spot. On this entire bit beach. And I don't see any... I don't see any books. I cannot dig one. I cannot fish one. I might have a glitch on my hands. Or the, the spot is somewhere under, under the ride or something. Can it? Wait. Wait. Seriously? Oh, my Eric statue. What are you doing, game? Wow. Well, that is inconvenient, to say the least. I can't believe this. I have a feeling... Oh my god, I see it from here. It's under the boat. And I cannot hit it. Wait, can I somehow magically... I, I think I need to be on top of the dock to hit, hit the spot. Why are you hiding them so hard? I mean, why do I have so much stuff on the beach? Alright, let's try to cast it without... Nah, it's not gonna let me. Disappointing. <laughs> the book has seaweed on it. I I I bet Merlin is gonna be happy. 
Here are the books. My girl Bale likes books. I have so much to tell you. Thank you, Sterling Sky. You found all the missing books. Now we can return them to Merlin. Please come with me. I'm sure he'll want to thank you. Au revoir. Mm -hmm. Uh, let's hang out. My God, her running animation is so cool. Look at this. Just like a Disney princess would run. Merlin, if you have a moment, there is something I'd like to discuss. Intellectual pursuit. Of course it's intellectual. It's Belle we're talking about. I'm gonna be right in the middle of your conversation. We found some of your missing books. That's stupendous! I was sure I'd never get them back. I must say, I'm quite impressed. I know. I'd like to invite you both to become honorary Dreamlight librarians. Oh boy. Is it a paid job or is it one of those internships? That would be wonderful. Thank you so much. Oh, okay, Belle. Belle, I'm, gonna, uh, I'm sure she's gonna love it. You'll have to familiar, f familiarize yourself with my classification system. Perhaps you can start by finding the proper place for all the books you've brought back. Sounds good. What if I put something on the wrong shelf? Then you perish. <laughs> don't you worry, I've cast an enchantment for such a possibility. Oh, so then we don't need to memorize anything. If you put something in the wrong section, the shelf itself will let you know. Great, so don't, we don't have to memorize anything. Knowledge, wisdom, higher learning. And he walked away. Go to Dreamlight Library. Wait, we... So Merlin's house is actually Dreamlight Library. The man literally lives in a library. He must be even more nerdy than Belle, and I love it. That's so cool. Well, to think about it, he doesn't even have a bed or a kitchen. I feel like Kristoff actually has a bigger library in his house than this. What the hell? Why is Kristoff's house not a library? Oh. I was able to find the correct spots for all three of these books. I'm hoping you can assist me. The first one is, is the sewing book you got from Mirabel, Crafty Creatures. There are only three classifications that I haven't tried. Owl Care, How to Train Your Sugar Pot, and Wondrous Arts and Crafts. Isn't it obvious? Of course it's owl care. That doesn't feel quite right, but let me try to put it back. Oh, I wanted to see an animation of the book being rejected by the shelf. As soon as I put the book on the shelf, it flew back into my hands. We must have the wrong category. Fine, let's do the boring way. So if that was your first choice, why ask me? Why ask me, Belle? You're a smart girl. I know I'm smart too, but you don't need to you don't need to ask me if you are confident. The book stayed in the shelf. Now the second book we need to shelf is the one Mr. McDuck borrowed called Coin Pool Party. The classifications, monetary physics and swim strokes, metamorph metamorphosis for beginners and magic duels 101. Oh come on! This is not even funny. Do you think the book is about swimming in actual coins? Is that possible? Of course it's possible. Have you met have you not met Scrooge before? I just don't think he needs a book. I think he's already a professional. Maybe he wrote it and now he reads it all the time to remind himself how amazing he is. I wouldn't be surprised. It worked. Awesome. The last book, Cursed Negotiations Making Better DVS Deals. Ursula got that book. She said it was very inspiring. The only shelves I haven't tried are wizard interior design, magical contract law, and prophecies what could go wrong. Oof, this is a tough one. I think magical contract law? 
doesn't it does just sound like you're about magical law, doesn't it? I don't think Ursula needs any laws. She she doesn't follow any laws. That was the right category, which means all of the books are now shelved. You've been such a wonderful help. Thank you. You're welcome. You did most of the work. It was a team effort. Finally, someone who values my talents. Thank you. If you if you guys are not going to value my talents, I'm going to go crazy like Forgotten did and uh, destroy the entire valley. So it's in your interest to make me in a good spirit. I had planned to start reading one of the books in the Dreamlight Library. Okay, which one? But while I was placing cursed negotiations, I found something at the back of the shelf hidden behind the other books. It's a f rather mysterious book written in letters I've never seen before. I wonder what it says. Could this be the first chapter of Adventure? That's what I was hoping too. I'm going to try and decipher the mysterious book. I have to know what it's about. Okay, that's going to be your whole friendship quest about books. This just makes me like you even more. You're welcome. I'll see you soon again as well. And the book hunt is complete. Two nerdy girls just hanging out, reading books. My suit is better though. No, but seriously, Belle, what a gorgeous character. Thank you so much for watching and huge thanks all of our supporters, guys. We're gonna, uh, I'm, I'm gonna have the videos on every single quest coming out very soon. So if you like following along, I'm sure you already completed all of these quests, but I get a lot of good feedback on these kinds of videos. So apparently you guys wanna relive the quest that you just went through through my eyes and uh you enjoy my reactions so this is what i'm here for thank you so much for watching huge thanks to everybody who supports the channel you guys are absolutely awesome and i'll see you in part two goodbye mm -hmm.